Oh, hi, Carrie Jackson. How are you? Geekshowpodcast.com welcomes you to the Basement Studios and our YouTube channel. Uh, if this is your first time, there's some adult language and adult situations headed your way. But hey, we talk about like Star Wars, Star Trek, Deadpool, Marvel Comics, DC Comics, all that cool stuff. So if you like that, stick around. So this, this is, is the thing that we well, used to make the funeral potatoes. Wait, I can't even get a fart joke out right now. <laughs> What'd you think, Jimmy? Didn't see it. You... I was about to say, I was like, I was like Jesus, oh, no. sounds like a problem. No, no, no. So, no. He'll eat leave first so he doesn't have to like deal with starvation. That's fine. Yeah. I can masturbate without my hands. That's true. Geekshowpodcast.com And we are back in the basement. Oh, it's so God basement damn. in here. Oh, I was going to say you, exactly that, yeah. Lee. I you were going to say, you were gonna say goddamn? No. Oh. Lee said it's so basementy in here. Oh, okay. Yeah. It is. Yeah. So very you basementy. You lucky people. Man, this is the third Who? show. You are oh, in the, for the it. listeners. All oh, the ones that are that we're, we're in their ears right now? Yeah. We're yeah. in their earbuds. Apparently, we make you laugh. We change your lives. That's right. You mother zeros ain't even really ready for what's about to occur to your mm. eardrums. Man, this is almost you the better to the facts hurry of life. And eat your yogurt in your cubicle. That's How right. do you know I eat yogurt in the morning? How would you know I work in a cubicle? cubicle? Who eats fucking yogurt at fucking three? Good point. Hmm. I, I do. Put, well, I put, is that? I put chia seeds in mine too. How does he know? Fucking Jimmy's like, oh, they're talking without me since. So <laughs> I went can off. feel yeah. it. Yeah. Just ignore him. Did uh, he just call us? I'm trying to get a hold of him. Oh, you're oh, maybe going the other way. But maybe it won't work. Yeah. Fuck yeah. that. He's in Hawaii. Fuck I know. off. I don't I want to talk to him in Hawaii. I know. I know. He He's feels left here. out. He feels left like, out. If I oh, call poor Jimmy. Feels left out. Shut up. Go talk to Will Forte, you fucker. <laughs> <laughs> Hello? Hello? <laughs> <laughs> Wait, can you all hear all right, let's uh, let's uh, let's let's go around the table and meet the panel. I'll start over here. Designated driver, producer of the program, uh, Quad T, Too Tall Tony. Hey guys, I got a Twitter at Quad T Tony. <laughs> uh -huh. I got a, another podcast that's about gadgets and games. That, uh -huh. That's that's uh, the Gadget Spot. Uh huh. It's on iTunes. <laughs> oh Jimmy. no, that's your caffeine meter just going down right there. <laughs> <laughs> Running boop, boop, boop. caffeine levels low. It's on iTunes, Podbean. And as soon as Google launches its podcasting stuff, actually, by now, they will have launched it. So oh, really? you should be on Google Podcasts. We supposed to launch. I can get to the phone right now. If you leave a message, oh, I will call you back. Shut up, <laughs> Jimmy. Let's leave him a message. I'm, I'm too busy eating fucking lobsters out of the sea. Out of the lobster hut. Lobster hut. All right. Yeah. They, just, they just boil up pre-cooked out of the ocean in Hawaii. Uh, Wednesday night's pub quiz, Mr. B. Yes. Shannon 8.30. Yes. 8. I don't know. Lucky 13. It's pretty good time. Show up sometime. It's me. That's all you need to know? Yeah. Drinking and yelling at people. It's fun. <laughs> He's your host with the most. Yeah. Shut up, dummy. Ah, yeah, <laughs> shithead. What's wrong with you? <laughs> Sometimes I hop on teams because I don't read Brian's questions. Yeah. And so I'll, like a, I'll be like a guest geek on your team. Oh, okay. Right. Yeah. That's and I'll cool. say, you know, and I, uh, I'm still getting out of bed. I'm going to work even though I don't want to. Hey, that's all yeah, of us here, you I think. You're, you're, here's, you're, here's you're, you're done soon. Yeah. yeah. I mean, this is... Actually, I've been done for a while. This is um, two weeks in well, the future. <laughs> this is, this is uh, the beginning of May. You were so close. close. Uh, getting so close. close. So close. Here's what's the hard thing, is I've got that adorable pit bull, uh, uh, Tilly. Yes. Yeah. Right. And uh, my alarm, I have one alarm that goes off super early. It's my phone. Mm -hmm. My last alarm is like, you got to get the fuck out of bed. Mm-hmm. Is 635. It's my clock radio. You guys. Uh, radio from Hell wakes me up. Mm -hmm. And it's always Bill for some reason. And I go, ah! It's because he talks the most. Right. It's because you've been terrified of him since you were dog, 15. <laughs> <laughs> the minute my dog hears uh, radio from Hell, she crawls on top of me and tries to like not let me leave. Don't go. And I'm like, God damn it, I don't want to go either. That's don't funny. Yeah. Yeah, my dog does that, too. Yeah. yeah but but mine weighs 75 pounds. It's true. <laughs> yeah, uh, Lee George Cade, everyone. Hi. Come visit me at my restaurant, Fresh Eatery, 145 East, 1300 South, Suite 201. Usually drunk and yelling at people, just like uh, Shannon is at Pub Quiz. Uh, but I won't tell you the answer to anything at all. Damn, Damn you're dude. not drunk there. Yeah, only once. That was a fun time. Anyway, uh, <laughs> actually, I will answer questions about uh, anything you want to know the answer to. I, I really will. 
I really he will. will. So because if he doesn't know, he'll make it up. I will make it up. Actually, make out uh, a surprisingly small amount of things. Mm-hmm. Uh, and if that doesn't work out for you, come join us at Geek Show Fit. That's our Facebook page where we just cheer each other on and make the world a better place with ponies and rainbows and uh, and we lift the ponies and we lift the ponies and we bench the rainbows. We squat the rainbows. And we talk about nutrition. Bench the rainbow. Squat the rainbow. <laughs> I you know do not squat the rainbow. <laughs> squat oh. The rain- Anybody okay. tells you to squat the rainbow, tell them to fuck the hell off because right. it is just not possible. All right. Anybody tells me to squat anything, I'll tell them that. I I I can't do a pistol squat yet, but I'm working. Pistol on it. squats are dope. Dude. Pistol squats are insane. I must yep. hear of these. Pistol squats a one leg squat. Oh. You can, you put one leg straight out in front of you like yeah. this, oh. and then you do a dude, squat. Do you with touch your anything yeah. to nope, balance? Nope. Nope. Oh, I could do like zero of those. Yeah. yeah it's, it's I'll dope. never be able to do one of those. I've got an. I've got yeah. a, a lady works for me who can do like thirty pistol squats. Wow. So, yeah. All right. Uh, Jay Whitaker. What's up? I'll be pistol squatting and shit. Yeah? You do a pistol squat? <laughs> On my left no, leg. Go do it. Right On here. my left leg. What about your, right, guys what what about your right, leg? right leg? We've got, oh. we, got oh. we got the YouTubes. So. Uh, uh, All right. All right. Pistol squat. Yeah. Okay. It's it's this become a, leg day. This is a super good uh, thing is, for, is for a podcast. Hi, everybody. My name is Jay Whitaker of the Geek Show Podcast. <laughs> He's talking. Yeah. He's talking about demonstrating a pistol he's squat. Talking to the I will. I will yeah. uh, you, describe it. Do what you can. Color commentary. Yeah. Yeah. There yeah. we go. He's he's I'm choosing a, a leg. Yeah. He's getting a okay, good. Guys, ready for this? A good uh, center. He's, he's lifted a leg out. Oh, no, can't do it. And ah. He bent down a little bit and gave up. Yeah. <laughs> Wait. He's gonna try again. All right. Okay. He's got his leg out. Nope. And he's done. <laughs> At this rate, I'm thinking I can do a pistol squat. He might. Jesus. Uh, he's put his hands behind his back. He looks kind of like those uh, Russian dancers. If this keeps up, Shannon and I are going to yeah. need a drink. Nope. Oh. All right. <laughs> and so. he has given up. <laughs> okay. No, no if Jay can't that, do, that was a fail. If no. Jay can't do it, nobody can do a pistol squat. Don't That's even right. try. It's true. It doesn't exist. It's not real. Can't do it. It's not real. Nope. My quads nope. hurt already. <laughs> hey. Uh, <laughs> Here he is. His quads hurt. Yeah. Gentlemen. Yeah. Um, follow me on Twitter at TokenJ, uh, DickVelvet.com, JayWhitakerComedy.com. Uh, I'm going to be in your era. Error. Er- yeah. Aria? Yeah, your yeah, Aria. You got you got a show this week? Uh yeah. Uh, at, at, at the, the Rush, Rush Bar. Bar and Grill out by <laughs> in Lake Forest. It's mm-hmm. like it's like my old stomping grounds for all you OC folks. Um all my people's back home. Come fuck with me there. I forget what time it is, but y'all know. Y'all live there. It's August 5th. Yeah. Or no. No, May 5th. May 5th, sorry. May 5th, the 5th of May. Cinco, Cinco de, de Mayo. Cinco de Mayo. Oh, my God. And it's on a Tuesday. Kay. Seriously. Yeah. It's taco on a Tuesday. Tuesday. Yeah. This is like the taco. This uh, shit is going down like central. This is going to be off the Are you sure? Hook. Yep. Yeah, no, yeah. Taco Tuesday is on Cinco de Mayo this year, like, for no, shit. No, no, Thursday. Oh, uh, uh, Taco Thursday. Oh, Taco Thursday. Yeah, Thursday. Well, it's Thursday. Thursday. Thursday, Thursday. That's right. Thursday de Mayo. Yeah, my my favorite game to <laughs> play Thursday is de Mayo. what does Cinco de Mayo commemorate? I thought it was Mexican independence. Uh, From what? Jimmy, Jimmy, if you're going to be this noisy, we can't have you. Jimmy. Stop eating chips. Where, where are you? <laughs> are you in a fucking wind tunnel? Yeah. yeah. Because we can't have this. Whoosh. Are you in a lobster? All right. <laughs> I don't know what you were doing. but I, I had to walk outside for a second. All right. Yeah. You're Hawaii okay now? Sounds... You're fine? Did you drag your phone along the carpet? What the <laughs> fuck was that? <laughs> <laughs> you, is Hawaii having a hurricane? All right. Jimmy Martin, everybody. Hello. Wasting his vacation in Hawaii. He must love us. It's not wasting now because now I'm, I'm waiting to do my interviews. So I'm just sitting around waiting to do yeah. those. Seriously, Whatever. if I ever go on a vacation, you guys try to call me. I'm gonna fucking throw my phone. Yeah, the like wall. you should I be. Told him. You should yeah. be jerking off to a sunset, like, and no one would blame you. It, yeah, I don't, <laughs> I don't know. Shane, yeah. you, you gave me a look like that was a really good <laughs> idea. That's, that's actually sun. Pawakapui Beach. Oh, really? <laughs> that's the jerk off of the Sunset Beach. I would use sunset. palm balm. Yeah. Huh. <laughs> Dr. Dongington's? <laughs> yes. SPF 600. <laughs> Dr. Tongington's Palm Balm. Jimmy's phone connection brought to you by Palm Balm. Yep. <laughs> Which explains why it's sliding in and out. Um, <laughs> oh, what's, yeah. Uh, what, I got that. Uh, what, do you, what do you got, Jimmy? What, uh, where, <laughs> that was a good joke. Where's your stuff? <laughs> uh, you can find me on KSL, The Arrow, Plug Magazine, uh, Mediocre Show. Hawaii. Uh, <laughs> the, the Eating Shows. Los Angeles. <laughs> Everywhere, pretty They're much. making a movie about snow. I'll be in fucking Antarctica. <laughs> <laughs> so tell me, Mr. Penguin, your part was really hard. How did you research? Uh, all right. 
Hey, what, what day does this come out? This is uh, the 2nd of May. Toasty the mail. end of this episode, you will hear me interview the cast of Civil War. Oh, cool. Oh, yeah. really? That's a thing? All right, now I see why you're you on this episode. more Marvel movies? How many, uh, how many people did you, you get in? You better check your mouth or I'll spoil the shit out of it. I had, I'll stop listening. <laughs> who, uh, who, did you, who did you get? Uh, I, I had uh, me and uh, Jay's best friend of uh, oh, Anthony Mackey and, and Sebastian stand together. Nice. Cool. And then I had uh, Paul Bettany and uh, Chadwick Boseman together. Oh, that's cool. And then I had the Russo brothers together. Mm. Oh, nice. What about Captain America? Nope. He was only doing nationals. No, that's bullshit. I'm, I'm, I'm not even going to listen to this. Guess what? Hmm? Don't give a shit. <laughs> <laughs> oh. All right. Thank you, Jimmy. Yeah. Thank you very thank much. Thank you. We'll have those at the end of the uh, episode. Stay I mean, tuned thank, for those. I mean, thanks, Jimmy. I mean, shit. I yeah. mean, you like you... I mean... Whatever, man. I just can't. Hey, Jimmy. I really appreciate you for spending your time with us right now. Can you do a pistol squat? Do you guys have a question for uh, Jason Sudeikis, Josh Gad, or uh, Maya Rudolph? Can we ask them something? Yeah. Ask them if they do pistol squats. Ask Josh Gad why he can't pick a good film project. Oh. Yeah, there you go. Because he's way too fucking talented to be in the shit that he's been in. <laughs> That'd be an awkward conversation. That's, it would be an awkward conversation. I, I really feel that way. He's just one of the most talented people in Hollywood right now, and he keeps picking these awful, awful projects. You know who else is a really talented person in Hollywood? Who's that? Kerry Jackson. Oh, jeez. Oh, Look what he did. Kerry oh, oh, Jackson. Look like what he one. just went I and did. Like Man, it. my increasing sobriety is helping me show. All right. Hey, um, I got a question for Maya Rudolph. Question for Maya Rudolph. Jimmy. Okay. Uh, hey, girl. What's your, what's your name? <laughs> Did you get that, Jimmy? You, you already know her name. No. <laughs> it's the question is, hey girl, what's your name? To Maya Rudolph. Oh yeah, sure, I'll do that. Absolutely. Yeah, it yeah. cool. might be your last junket if you ask that question. <laughs> I like Maya Rudolph. <laughs> so how can how can we hear your show, Carrie? You know, you can ask oh. uh, Jason Sudeikis. Never mind. <laughs> <laughs> Here we go. Go ahead. It begins. What, what is it okay, we, Carrie? What should we ask Jason Sudeikis? What's, what's your name, boy? Um, do you cry with joy every time you see your wife naked? Oh, yeah. That's Who's his wife? <laughs> Who's his wife? Cool kid. January <laughs> Jones. Yeah. January, January Jones? Jones? No. Well, they're, not, they're not married, but they're dating. There they are. Oh, no. Jason Sudeikis is Olivia Munn. Yeah, oh, Olivia I'm, Munn. I'm thinking of the guy, uh, Last Man on Earth. Yeah. I get those two mixed up all the time. Will Forte and Olivia Jason Munn. You got Will Olivia Forte? Munn? Yeah. Oh, yeah. He's married. The they have... fuck? Yeah. Olivia Wilde. Olivia, Olivia Wilde. Wilde. Olivia Wilde. Oh, Olivia yeah, That's Wilde. Jimmy's girlfriend. Ha ha. He married your girlfriend. Olivia Wilde? Yeah. Uh, so, I mean. Oh. Olivia, Olivia Munn dates baseball players exclusively, so mm. never mind. <laughs> I mean, they're, they're pretty people. They Isn't must just Olivia get bored having sex, you know? Yeah. This is Pretty sex is so boring. She's pretty. There's too many Olivia's. It's a lot. Oh, hot. I think I, I would ask Shannon's question. I'd say, uh, every time you see her, do you kind of freak out like Kermit the Frog with like arms blazing? Like, ah! <laughs> <laughs> Our very special guest, Olivia Wilde. <laughs> My penis in the bedroom. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Anyway, all right. Let's uh, let's get this going. Um, let's get this over with. Let's, <laughs> let's see what we got here. Um, we we work all day to get to the third show, and then we can't wait to get through it. We can't Man, wait to get through yeah. it. Third it's show, hard. no third show is told to, told. I've just got a lot of leftover. Man, that's, man, that's just hard. That about, <laughs> that about sums it up, Jay. I got mostly a lot of leftover, like quick. You Let's know. go that. Yeah, it's funny. Let's listening, do it. Listening because you know, like we're gonna go off on stupid tangents. Yeah, listening to Jay right now is kind of like listening to my wife's grandmother. Yeah, he <laughs> just looks at you. He's like, this dude is total. <laughs> uh, I'm just tired at this point. Like I'm legit tired. Uh, um, you want some Ativan? I've got some in the car. No, I'm cool, man. Morphine? I'm straight, Got dog. that, too. I want to read the stories. Okay, read the stories. So we're getting another uh, R-rated comic book TV series? What's TV that? Series. Series. Not what? movie? Not movie. Series. Yeah, what is, what is this, it? This broke a few weeks ago, and I forgot to tell you guys about it. Okay. Um, it seems like uh, Garth Ennis has taken a liking to Seth Rogen and Evan Goldberg. Because yeah. oh. sure. like, like, he wants money. Are they, they going to do Metropolitan? One? They're going to do Transmetropolitan? They're going to do The Boys. The Boys, okay. Mm -hmm. I, 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 I think we kind of, I think we talked about it. Uh, did we? Yeah, I mentioned it briefly, but uh, but this it's it is happening. It's happening on Cinemax. What's oh. the Boys? Uh, the Boys is, is it's a troop of uh, boys? people that basically go and they're like the cops that take care of superheroes. Uh, the Boys is a special CIA group whose job it is to keep a watchful and forceful eye on the superheroes of the world. Yeah. So they have powers and stuff too, hmm. or I don't think they do. No, do they? some of them have powers, but there's one guy that has a bulldog. Is his name Lockjaw? No, it's, 
<laughs> God damn it. Uh, <laughs> later this month. Okay. Yeah. Uh, with Preacher. Preacher's that close? Yeah. Ugh. Wow. Uh, here's another uh, <laughs> series. Okay. That we're getting. Hit me. You'll know this one. I will. Death Note. Death Note. A That's uh, from uh, the anime. We're getting mm-hmm. a live action? It's a guy that uh, mm-hmm. summons a Shinigami by having a notebook that allows you to write down somebody's name, and within half an hour, they'll die. Mm-hmm. I understood and notebook. He, he decides, He decides. <laughs> and what's interesting is he decides he's going to make Japan a better place by writing down the name of serial killers, rapists, and criminals. Mm-hmm. And then it's, he becomes God. It's going to be on Netflix. Interesting. The Shinigami in that is freaky. Freaky, freaky what's fucking. What's a Shinigami? It's a death demon, like a death god. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Well, don't like... talk to me like that. I don't know. I was asking you. Is it like an origami? <laughs> no, no, not an origami. It's no. a shinigami. Oh. Jesus. Uh, and then there's Shikibane Hime, but that's a corpse princess. That's a whole other thing. Shikibane Shikibane Hime. Is that like an origami? No. Okay. That's a Shikibane. It's like a, a death corpse princess that huh. brings souls to the, to the afterlife. It's my favorite goddamn uh, Tim Burton movie. Shikibane Hime? I'm surprised he hasn't The death made corpse it. princess. <laughs> the death corpse princess. <laughs> The origami princess? Uh, then there's uh, this. Um, the Long Dead Lobo movie. Oh, please, Glenn Danzig. Resurrected. <laughs> oh, man. Shut the fuck up. Oh, or Glenn Danzig to play Lobo. Has been resurrected. Uh, the writer of the Wonder Woman movie has been hired to write the screenplay. Did Glenn Danzig write Wonder Woman? Well, I, I, and I read that the uh, director of Deadpool was like, eh, do it. Yeah, yeah, he's too busy doing that goon movie. But here's the thing: well, isn't he doing Deadpool two they now? They gotta do the, the real Lobo. Like, I don't know if like anybody's reading like DC's Lobo right now. I, he's uh, like this shitty Twilight, uh, yeah, fucking goth yeah. vampire yeah, piece you, of shit. He's, he's a lot. Can't do that. Is it lo- is it kid Lobo? <laughs> it's kind of yeah. It's like a young Lobo that's not yeah, cool. No. Ew. Yeah. You know, I'm like, so, I, like, you can't be the I'm main sorry, man when you were yeah, main. No, piece he's of not. Shit. And that's the thing. I look at DC and I just go, what the fuck are you doing? This 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 is the demon from Death Note. By Get the, the way. fuck! Is yeah. Whoa, so if, whoa, if, they, is if they if they ah! I already showed it to the camera. It's like David Bowie. <laughs> no, it's like it's like <laughs> it's like apple. Bowie bleached his face and then you know went and hung out with the misfits for. And then had bought an apple. It looks yeah. like the Joker went to an S and M party and really <laughs> yeah. decided. That's to a good. That's, that's it went to fa- that's, that's a solid. That's a solid. Here's a better solid description. Here's a solid description. I love that you guys are so supportive of each other. Thank you. Thank you. That was a good description. This for. For Shannon, because I know he likes Judge Dredd. Fuck yes, I do. We we love Judge Dredd together. What would make Judge Dredd better? <laughs> Get the Judge fu- Death. Oh my God, I saw the head. Yeah. Judge oh Death. my God, I Judge saw Death. If I were to add, Get the fuck out of here. Christopher Walken, Predator. Oh, what? And how about what? if I were to add aliens in a movie? No, in a comic book. Oh, no, no, fuck it. I don't care. <laughs> <then>. <laughs> okay. Cause, I don't care. Because my, my favorite my favorite comic book to this day is Judge Dredd and Batman. Judge Dredd that and Batman. was good. It was a crossover, Judge oh. Dredd and Batman. Somehow Batman ended up in the mega block, yeah. and uh, Judge Dredd actually hangs the scarecrow at the end of it Ooh. Uh-huh. Ooh. and lights his body on fire. It's not canon. He no, deserved I it. don't think it's canonical at <laughs> it's all. It's not canon. Yeah. <laughs> not <laughs> canon. And Batman at one point looks at Scarecrow's body and goes, huh. It just walks away. Wouldn't that be the only way we're going to get another Judge Dredd movie? Is if, like, okay, you can have Judge Dredd, but you need Predator, you need Alien, and you need, like, 17 other franchises crammed in there, so we'll make another Judge Dredd <laughs> Jason Dredd. versus Freddy versus Michael versus <laughs> Alien <laughs> versus Predator <laughs> versus <laughs> Ash versus, versus Rugrats you'll versus wanna, GoBots. You'll want to read this because me, no? the writer is uh, John Lehman, who did Chew. I love Chew. Oh, okay. Yeah. So there you go. Chicken's illegal in Chew. Yeah. yeah. Everybody eats... Uh, Tofu. <laughs> yep. It's like my world. <laughs> She's well, great. It, about, well, I guess Dredd talks a little bit. He mainly grunts. Like, none of those characters talk. <laughs> so you don't really need a writer. You just need a, an action plotter, a yeah. choreographer. Yeah. A grunter. A storyboarder. Ah. Uh, oh, here's something. What? This is uh, because we've been to San Diego Comic-Con. Yes. We have. And what is it that Shannon and I always tell you? Stay outside. You don't really need to go. Don't sleep on the fucking sidewalks, stupid. I, re- I regret that. <laughs> well, the general manager of San Diego Comic Con has announced that they're going to do an app. For what? For the Hall H panels. Oh, like a will call? You can just watch it. I bet. So you can just watch it. Well, then wow. I'm not even wow. going to San Diego anymore. Hey, respect. If I we can watch it. <laughs> we can watch it in the bar instead of just reading about no, it. Seriously, I, I go with you guys and hang out at the Tilted Kilt and just watch it on the iPad. Yeah, but hey, Carrie, this, that was a solid announcement. But this is how <laughs> fucked. Up, no, this is how <laughs> fucked up this is. Okay, he thought, oh, we'll do an app. You can see the Hall H panels, right? Well, not necessarily. 
mm-hmm. won't be streamed live, mm-hmm. which doesn't matter again because no, it doesn't. The it internet doesn't. beats you to yeah. it. Oh yeah, for sure. Well, it's because there's a there's fifteen thousand people like us sitting in there tweeting it out there. The studios may or may not include the footage because oh, a lot geez. of times it's just stuff they're experimenting with, right? You yeah. know, and they don't want you to have that permanent thought in your head about it. So it, you may or may not get scenes from these movies that they're showing. <laughs> and to make it even more stupid, they're going to charge you for it. Oh, oh God. Wow. No, no. Wow. I will, I will tell you, that was like one of my favorite uh, Comic-Con memories where like everybody's getting yeah. ready to sleep out. And you and I just looked at each other and we're like, ah, oh, fuck this. We're too old. I was just looking Us two fucking wonderful divas. We got to get out we of went, here. We went, we went to sleep. We got up the next morning. Went and got some <coughs> nice breakfast. Yeah, and, sat and, and, watched, and started having drinks, and then then this then the reports started coming. Right. In. And like and like Jimmy would be sitting in the hall, and she's like, "They do shows." I was like, "Yeah, I know. I saw that like five minutes ago on Twitter." <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You know what I know? I know exactly. I know exactly what feed they're going to use because uh, a couple of years ago, my friend got me above Hall H is uh, like private rooms, like like the green rooms for the celebrities, like basically so they can get hammered before they go up, get, you know, yeah. stand before five thousand people. And there was, a, there was a monitor there, and this was a year that uh, No Way in the Huntsman was coming out. And all their fr- like friends, sisters, brothers, you know, co-workers are watching this monitor. Of, you know, Kristen Stewart, Kristen, you know, Kristen Stewart, all them on stage. And they go, we haven't really filmed anything, but here are the costumes, you know, that, you know the, the concept designs, right? And they're all sitting there, and all of a sudden the screen goes blank. And all of them are, like, freaking out. They're like, what the hell happened to the feed? And they're like, oh, like, there's anything that's, like, trailer-wise or, like, special, like, they cut off the feed so no one can, like, take pictures. So I guarantee you, like, it's going to just be like that. Every time, like, if you're watching the Batman Superman panel, but like, here's the trailer. It's just going to go dark. Why the fuck would you pay for it? Yep. Another Does, bad decision from San Diego Comic-Con. Does it sound like Jimmy's talking <sighs> into the asshole of the corpse of Orson Welles? A little bit. Yeah. Dude, are you in the bathroom a right now? Bit. Oh. Hey. Jimmy, we're losing you. Jimmy. You me? Yeah. Are you in a bathroom? Are you in a bathroom? No. Are you in Are you in Hall H? Yeah, and... I'm popping the squat right now. <laughs> well, that's what I'm oh, doing. We just thought you were in there for the ambiance. I know. We, you, yeah, we, that's what <laughs> we're did. all doing. Yeah, we, uh, yeah. We, went, we, we, weren't, we weren't holding it against you. We, yeah. We've was done that. Was that a real fart? Was <laughs> that your mouth? That was I, my mouth. I tried to <laughs> pop a pistol squat. It didn't go <laughs> well. <laughs> I thought you really farted. <laughs> nah. All right. That was a good, that was a good sounding fart. Tony. Oh. Thanks, guys. <laughs> I pride myself on my <laughs> mouth flatulence. <laughs> Eric. Mouth Eric. flatulence. Oh, I love you, fucking idiots. We call, oh. that, a, we call that a fart herp where I'm from. <laughs> I love After fart. these <laughs> messages, <laughs> we'll be right. Make a mouth fart. <laughs> <laughs>